I'm Dave Buchanan, Director of Consultation for FirstNet. Going forward, FirstNet will embark on four key elements to help us reach those goals in 2016. One is a kickoff meeting between FirstNet and the SPOC. The purpose of this is to connect FirstNet with the state team and the state single point of contact to discuss the expanded outreach and to begin planning for the remainder of the consultation year. There is always a value to face-to-face. -to -face. And we can't wait for FirstNet to come back and do the second round of consultation. I think our team and our first responders out there are looking forward to hearing more and getting involved. We would love to see more end users come out and tell us, you know, what they expect, what do they need from FirstNet, and how, you know, how it would change their lives as first responders. The second key element is to engage FirstNet with the governance team and the governance body meeting in the state. In so order to get critical inputs from the state, understand what the key issues are for the state in 2016, and to bring updates to the state regarding the FirstNet acquisition. Obviously very excited about FirstNet. We're looking forward to our second round. Uh, we know this has to have uh, the approval of our governor eventually. So I think from the, the state sheriff's point of view and law enforcement point of view, what I would look to do is, is increase the education. And that can be done at our level. You know, we're, we're so close to having broadband that uh, people don't realize we could sit in New York State and talk to California with public safety broadband in a matter of seconds. The third key element for 2016 is the convening of consultation task teams. The purpose of these task teams is to bring subject matter experts from the state and connect them with FirstNet in order to obtain inputs from the state uh, regarding network operations and management topics like prioritization and public safety grade. What's really exciting is, uh, you know, working with the state and being the outreach and education manager. Everybody wants to know how much, how much is it going to cost? What, what's it going to cost to buy in? But we're very clear about in our message is that, you know, really, this is about getting everybody that we can at the table. Um, we really don't have anything to sell you. Um, you know, we don't want you to drink any Kool-Aid. We want you to participate in the process because the process is really important. And um, that is one of the things that I appreciate about this. FirstNet has given us the ability to go out on the front end and say, how do you want it built? What do you need? What kind of applications are you looking at? What kind of capabilities do you want to do? The fourth key element of 2016 consultation is the executive consultation meeting. FirstNet will engage with the state through this executive consultation meeting, connecting FirstNet officials with key influencers, key decision makers, and key officials from local, tribal, state, metropolitan, public safety in order to bring about robust dialogue about the decision the state and decision makers will be making about FirstNet in the future. And we don't know until those consultations happen what the various stakeholders bring to the table. And we won't know unless and until they come to the table and bring, the, bring it to the table. At the beginning, we didn't have a lot of uh, concrete information and our and our stakeholders are really um, hungry for that. They want to know about it and they want to know how FirstNet's going to address some of their concerns. So I think we have a great opportunity for open dialogue and interaction between our stakeholders FirstNet and Washington OneNet.